hello guys you're welcome back to my channel yes in today's video we'll be talking about how you can move to the u.s as a teacher hi right, guys you're welcome back there are also agencies that recruit teachers to the u.s yes so this is what we'll be talking about in this video so if you're a new subscriber you're welcome please subscribe to this channel give this video a thumbs up and share for those that will benefit from it and if you're a returning subscriber you are very much welcome so uh, my name is omar Wumi. on this channel we talk about teaching teaching in the uk lifestyle um, sometimes we do story time so if this is the kind of content you like to watch please um, stay tuned join the family and then um, you're welcome so in this video we'll be talking about moving to the u.s yeah that is what we're talking about today so there are also agencies that move that recruit teachers to the u.s to teach and there's this particular one i'm going to talk about in this video which is the global um partner yeah the global teaching partners so i'll be talking about this agency on this um in this video so this agency they are act, they actually recruit teachers um into the us that is what they do they on the j1 visa now the j1 visa is a type of visa whereby you can move to the us as a teacher whereby you can teach for five years you get paid you're, you're going to teach you the um the j this this visa is actually for you to move to the us to teach for five years through this program you get your visa you'll be recruited into the u.s to teach how you can apply on their website i'm going to drop the link to this website the global teaching practice i'm going to drop the link i sent them an email and they sent me um all the requirements we'll be talking about in this video so the global teaching partners is an official authorized j1 exchange visitor sponsor designated by the u.s department of state and recognized they are approved by the north carolina department of public instruction the south carolina department of education and the virginia um, department of education so these are the subjects elementary education world language subjects of high demand just like science and mathematics so those are the subjects um, they need teachers for and the global educator program is designed for international teachers to gain experience experiential knowledge of the u.s participate actively in cross-cultural activities with u.s schools and communities and at the conclusion of their exchange they'll have to return back home to their country because on this j1 visa they cannot um, get a pr or a green card or probably if they switch during this program then they can um get their pr or a green card so international teachers will be classified as global educators they will offer k-12 teaching positions primarily in north carolina and allowed to stay five years before they are required to return to their home countries once hired in the school districts global will head in their cultural transition and provide support throughout their employment so these are the steps to take while applying with global teaching partners. The first step is the initial application. The applicant should first complete global initial application. The applicant's responses to their initial application will determine if the applicant meets the minimum requirement. And then you can now move on to the step two application. And then the step two application is the question here. If the applicant successfully passes the initial application, Global will send the applicant an email with a linked questionnaire to gather additional details, including contact information, teaching history, demographics, and family specifics. At the bottom of the questionnaire, the applicant will be required to submit supporting document, which includes a resume, which is a CV, driver's license, and then their bachelor's degree. So the third step is the phone interview once the applicant's questionnaire has been reviewed global will invite eligible applicants to participate in a short telephone interview to discuss compatibility with the program and provide more information about teaching in the u.s step four is the required document following a successful telephone interview global will collect required documents from the applicants to further determine their eligibility for the program and then step five is the first video interview if all the if all of the applicants required documents are accepted global will invite the applicant to schedule a video interview which is conducted virtually information about the interview will be provided through email and then the step six is required documents following a successful first video interview global will request additional documents to further determine the applicant's eligibility 
and then step seven which is the second video interview after the additional required documents have been submitted global will invite the applicant to schedule a second video interview which will be conduct will be conducted over zoom information about the interview will also be provided through email step eight is notification of acceptance into candidate pool once the applicant has successfully completed a phone interview two videos interviews and submitted and submitted all documents they will now be the global candidate pool step now is the candidate pool those accepted into the global candidate pool will work with global staff to complete a teacher's portfolio which is shared with global district partners during the hiring period um Candidates are also invited to complete virtual professional development modules to prepare for any interviews with schools or district partners. Yeah, so these are the requirements in which global teaching partners are recruiting teachers into the U.S. So for me, I will have a step, the, probably step six or seven, you should have your internationals, international passport. Yeah, so in some countries it's called travel transport so have your international pass if you don't have one get one ready if it's about to expire it is better you renew your international passport and then i would leave the link to this um agency global teaching partners and i will also um drop other agencies recruiting teachers into the us but with this global um teaching partners they actually have like a connection or i would say have affiliated with um teaching in the u.s yes that is what they do so try and apply follow these steps and then i wish you good luck so if you want to know more about what i've said about the global teaching partners you can just go on their website and read through for yourself everything i say here is i'm not a recruiter yeah i'm not a recruiter i don't recruit people to abroad but everything i say here is based on personal experience what i online research so you can also go online Click on the link and then you can also research and read for yourself. So guys, I will see you in my next video. Bye.